Members of both Yukon's police and fire unions met here at City Hall this afternoon to discuss the city's financial investigation. Now, even though the mayor says that the police services and the fire services will not be impacted, members of the police union tell me they're not so sure. KOCO first broke the story last week that more than $1.3 million was taken from the capital improvement bonds to pay for general expenses without the city council's knowledge. Now the city is looking into how they're going to make their funds last throughout the year. In a meeting last night, the mayor of Yukon said that layoffs were to come, but that city services such as police and fire would not be impacted. But the city still won't say which departments will see layoffs. Today, members of the Yukon Police Union and Fire Unions are meeting behind closed doors to discuss the financial investigation. They told KOCO they're working to make sure that no positions are cut within their department. In Yukon, Crystal Price, KOCO 5 News.